Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Dr. Sam's Biology. In this video, we will discuss rules of extra chromosomal inheritance. So, which type of rules extra chromosomal inheritance follows? So, first rule is it does not follow Mendelian inheritance. We know that in case of Mendelian inheritance, when we cross between two traits for example if we are crossing between toll and dwarf then in f1 what we will get we will get toll in f2 after selfing so this is f2 what we will get we will get 3 ratio 1 such ratio does not found in case of extra chromosomal inheritance so let's understand this suppose this is female and we are crossing it with this one and this is male. So in that case, we know that we have this. So this is toll. F1 is toll. So when we cross, suppose now this is female and we are crossing it with this one this one is male so our f2 will be the genotype of this if this is toll because this is coming from mother extra chromosomal inheritance means inheritance of cytoplasm that is present in the egg so if this is coming from mother this is toll then our f2 will be toll so here we can see that it is here you can see that it is not 3 ratio 1 it is all are told so here we can see that it does not follow Mendelian inheritance this is first rule second results of reciprocal crosses are not seen we know that in case of Mendelian inheritance results of reciprocal crosses are always seen here look at this if this is female this is male there will always be 3 ratio 1 and it will always be toll. If we reverse this, suppose this is male and this is female, ratio will be same. That means results of reciprocal ratios in case of Mendelian inheritance are always same. But here in that case, result of reciprocal crosses are not same, they are different. Let us understand this with this example. Suppose this is toll, this is dwarf, and this is female, this is male. So our F1 is toll. And when we revert the sexes, now suppose look at this. This is female, small t, small t, and this is male. Now you will see that this small t is coming from mother and this is coming from father. Extra chromosomal inheritance is case of so DNA or gene or always inherited from mother. So it will be dwarf. So here we have took same trait that is tall and dwarf. Here also tall and dwarf. But when we reverse the sexes, the results are different. So results of reciprocal crosses are different you can say that so our second rule is results of reciprocal crosses are not seen in case of extra chromosomal inheritance third is inheritance in most cases is uniparental means only one parent is involved and usually in most of cases inheritance is maternal means gene comes always comes from mother so here inheritance is uniparental in case of mendelian inheritance it is always biparental we know that half of half the number of chromosome are uh, you can say inherited from mother and half are inherited from father but here it is uniparental fourth rule is genes are present in cytoplasm in case of Mendelian inheritance we know that genes are present inside nucleus on chromosomes but here genes are present on cytoplasm in cytoplasm not on nucleus last rule is 
extra nuclear inheritance is not affected by substitution of nucleus with different genotype. Suppose this is zygote and this is nucleus. If this nucleus is substituted by another nucleus from another species of another genotype, if I put this nucleus here, genotype of nuclear genes has been changed. But here mitochondria are there. Inside mitochondria we know that DNA is there. This DNA or these genes are not affected by substitution of nucleus. So in this here this means that inheritance is not affected by substitution of nucleus. If we substitute this nucleus with this one extra chromosomal inheritance is not affected. So these are rules of extra chromosomal inheritance. First, it does not follow Mendelian inheritance. Second, results of reciprocal crosses are not same. They are different. Inheritance in most cases is uniparental and usually maternal. Inheritance occurs through mother. Genes are present on cytoplasm, not on nucleus. It is not affected by substitution of nucleus with different genotype. So these are rules of extra chromosomal inheritance.